it's still dark. Mary Tink Quinn here again. Um, I'm going to put yesterday's vlog up, but this is the continuance of it. Um, so, I went to church yesterday with uh, a little bit and my husband. And uh, I got prayed for for depression. And the lady told me that uh, it's really hard. She lost her dad at 19, and then she uh, she prayed for me, um, and then she gave me a hug, and then one of my very good friends <coughs> that goes to the church, that, that works for the church, or with it, um, she said uh, she lost her mom and her dad, and she still hasn't got over it, so obviously I'm not going to be getting over this. And I'm just going to keep being depressed. But the good thing is that I get to go to therapy sessions or whatever to get it all out. I keep crying over it. But the thing is, it, it kind of gets a little easier because the songs that I used to listen to whenever last week, it, it, I, I cried like a baby. And now it's like... Like, I don't even cry, so, I guess that's a good thing, I don't know. But I do listen to my dad's voice, um, singing every night. I didn't last night, because, well, I had other means, kind of. Um, I forgot to, I, <laughs> we're exercising last night with Julia Michaels, um, 2009 edition. And I was like really, really, really tired, so I just fell asleep. Um, so today I'm going to do laundry with our pastor, pastor lady, um, and she feeds us pizza, which is not the healthiest thing in the world, but whatever is food. Um, and then I'm gonna go later on. I'm gonna go grocery shopping a little bit uh, in Kroger's. But, um, I don't think that it's going to be easy for me to uh, do a day-by-day -day thing. Like my friend told me last night I'd have to do it day-by-day, -day and it doesn't get any easier. I uh, still miss him a lot. Even with all the pictures I have, I just, I can't. I can't imagine my, any, you know, a day without my dad, and now I have to, I'm forced to. And my stepmom's not making it any easier, to be honest. She's just, I think she's make. I know this is her grieving part too, but I think she's just trying to make it as if it was, it was she's the only one that lost him. No, I came from his loins, so therefore I knew him first. Remember, actually, my mom knew him first. My biological mom did. No way. First his mom did, my granny, then it was my mom, and then it was me. So, um, but still, you know, she acts as if she's the only one that missed, you know, that, that lost my dad, which is not true, so. You know, my stepsister. They're steps, so they're not really related, but my sister made a pact with, or promise with my dad that, after he dies, they would still be a part of our family. Mm -hmm. She wouldn't have done that, but whatever. So I guess she's still part of the family. She's been with the family for 25 years, so I guess that counts. And I woke up today not feeling well, but uh, I'll have to get over that because... I haven't been eating, I'm not going to lie, I haven't been eating very well 
for the past week. I know I've lost a lot of weight since then. I've just been drinking Gatorade and water and whatever I can find that's drinkable because I honestly don't want to eat, but I've ate here and there, but not, not nearly as much as I have before my dad died. That's just part of the depression. My sister um, and my son and I talk um, over this zap called Zillow. It's a really good app. It, uh, it's pretty much a walkie-talkie. Uh, she contacts me through that now. And um, every day she asks me how I'm doing and I ask her how she's doing. And then we just talk about random stuff like Christmas and whatever else you can think of. So, okay, this is the second video. Um, if you like to subscribe to my channel, uh, please. And, um,. I should be doing another one here in a couple of days. I just haven't been getting around to it because I've been trying to keep my mind off my dad's death. I've been cleaning and just getting Facebooking and doing my regular stuff that I that I do on an everyday basis. Just trying to not think about it. Uh, so, anyways, um. I'm gonna pop off here and wait on Miss Lisa to get here. So. Alright, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.